Uh, she's got she's got spunk. I think is the word. He's playing an invisible piano. Ah, is that so? What did you think? So, you were the one who brought Faye and his girl to me. I realized it the minute I saw the two of them. Why, how could I help but notice? They looked the spinning image of you and her. Yes, just as you yourselves looked way back then. Groff. Right? Laycan? What? Groff is Laycan. What do you mean, he's still alive? Yes. Ridiculous. Didn't Ramses shoot him down? She was also on the gear that Ramses shot down. I won't have her die. But, there is already a mother. Although she may be the anti-type, as long as the current mother exists, as far as I see it, that is not complete. Quite picky, aren't you? Didn't you say you threw away all human emotions? I don't care what you think. Anyway, as far as he can, as he is concerned, I will put Ramses onto him. Any objections? Where is he presently? Etronach is destroyed, but part of the memory cube still active. We should still be able to locate individuals. Wait a moment. He has left the crash site and is headed towards Ignis. I see. So he has left the area. That means it is only a matter of time before the seal is broken. Did you say something? It's nothing. Just sit there and wait for the good news. What about retrieving the girl? The key is already beginning to resonate. The time of the resurrection is near. We can get the girl any time. It doesn't have to be now. Let's take our time. Uh-oh. Battle music! On my way to Ignis, I re-encountered him. Karin Ramses. Ramses once again stood in my way, in his Omnigear, Vendetta. It was an unavoidable battle. I released the new function that was added to my Mark II gear, System Id! He barely looks different. Please pose a mass power to attack. Okay. Oh, attack level infinite. I like that. Uh. Seriously, the, the attack's name is Go 10 X. Let's do Go 10 X. Go Go 10. He missed. Okay, seriously, this is acting very slow. Hold on while I try to figure out what the problem is. Alright, I think that fixed the problem. Uh, let's go for Go 10 again. This time, it should go a little bit faster. There we go, it's... Mm. And this time it hits... for 5,000 damage! Go, go, Go 10. Broke the blaze pose, yeah. Unlike every single attack that you've had with this guy yet, you want to break his pose. Let's get a booster on. And then Vendetta comes, does zero damage, but it looks like we lost system id. That's okay, we got a ton. Ton of health, ton of fuel it looks like, 6600. So let's just go for regular attacks for a little bit now. It's kind of unlucky that I missed that first go 10. Uh, that would have been another 5000 damage. That would have helped out a lot. Let's get up to level 3 attack here. I believe that all the uh, all the combos have changed since uh, since the upgrade. Blaze pose a mass power to attack. So as long as I hit this time, should should break the pose. So go Ryubu. Any mm -hmm. I missed. 
And then whenever you miss, he counters. <sighs> that is not good. I don't know why the forest is so slow for, for gear battles. I've never understood that. Can't break the pose. And so he is building up power still. Okay, so I get another shot at it. Uh, I thought you only had two tries, so I'm going to go for a combo. Any one of them should be powerful enough to break it. 2,000 more damage. Not powerful enough to break the pose. What? Mega Flare. No! He's Bahamut now! Uh, that did quite a bit of damage. So let's just build up... Build up our attack level again. He blocked again because he's a dick. But down he... G wait, down he goes? Ramses' absolute confidence was shattered, leaving only his cry of disbelief and resentment. Ramses' machine disappeared into a sea of foliage. Why he was so fixated on me, I know not why, but he did say this. If only you didn't exist. What? If only I didn't exist, what? In order to disperse the nanomachines, Emeralda and I headed for one of the ruins of the Zebuim civilization, the mass driver facility. So everything's kind of like told in a monologue. Whatever. Fortunately, the facility was still active, which allowed us to proceed on to the central control room with little difficulty. I'd rather, you know, do this. I want to infiltrate the place myself, but whatever. Along the way, we saw various missiles and giant rockets that were created during the Zebuim era. They stood like tombstones of that ancient civilization. It was a graveyard for a race of people who destroyed each other over pride and arrogance. Once arriving at the central control room, we met up with Satan, who helped us activate the mass driver. We succeeded in launching the capsule containing the nanomachine, which would release the seal limiter. So Satan met us there. That looks like the, um... What do you call it? Place in, in Europe where they're trying to make antimatter. The ring like that. Oh, but this one launches a cannon! All that power for a cannon. And the nano machines have been released into the air. Hopefully they will release everyone's limiter. I don't know what that is. Is that the Ethos headquarters? It's kinda what it looks like. Except I thought that place was ruined. I think that's l that's Lehan. Yeah, definitely Lehan. We should see Doc's house. There it is. There's Doc's house. Although nobody's there, because Yui left. Oh, and the orphanage too. Nano machines for everybody. It's like a metallic snow. Oh, Nissan as well. Nissan also gets nano machines. Every place on the map must get nano machines. The nano machines that were scattered into the upper atmosphere began to multiply and spread throughout the whole of the world. The nano machines glittered in the sunlight, flowing like a large river in the sky. That glitter would remove the bonds restraining everyone. It was to be our light of hope for regaining, for regaining back our true freedom. Why are they in a chair? Whatever. Solaris's mobile su surface supreme. Wow. Solaris's mobile surface supremacy weapon invaded the area with great force. Shabbat and Nissan standard ba gear battalions were no match against it. It was only a matter of time before the Solaris mobile weapon arrived in Nissan. After we pushed back the Solarian gear units, we headed for Nartum to the Kisa of Capital's administrative district. We went there to obtain our one and only means of standing up against the mobile weapon. Save current data! Yes, I will! 
because I that's actually going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Xenogears. I am done reading. Hope you guys did enjoy this part. Right as we hit 59 hours. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.